Right, other way then. I see something twinkling. See? Well, if you put things in the way of doors, it stops and shutting automatically. Who says self-help books don't work? Charlie threw it down here earlier. Of course he did. Yeah, you just stand there, not help out. It's gonna jump scare me, isn't it? <laughs> Dinner at nine PM. Bit late in it. What's that? Wait, hey, look at this. What? It's a true crime book. Look at the author, Joseph Morello. So the guy on the ferry wasn't you met. Wow. Bethany. Mm. Was that in the sign in book? It's coming from through here. Dog ball. Honey.
Oh yeah, hello. I didn't see that before, but did I? He's upset. Please stop crying, mommy. Please stop crying, mommy. So where's daddy? on that one is there. No. It can use a pencil to find out what was written, can she? What? What ripped paper? I see. Nineteen ninety going to be an animatronic <laughs> told you no oh my god all right then dead person
He had a key. He's still alive. It's a bit charred, but he's still alive. <coughs> ah, Phoenix. Oh, I'm gone. Oh, it's not a key. If that's the way out. Oh, hello, what's that? Well, I don't think he got much justice. Climb up there now. Did I just go past it? Oh, a locked door. Go, 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 go. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, you didn't give me that time. No, 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 no. We don't need to do anything. I don't trust them. I do not trust them at all. Right, keep off. You're going to get crushed. Automated waste disposal. Switch off and lock out. Stay clear of moving belt. Evacuate the area immediately. Hmm. And that's, that's going to be our way out. That's still going to be locked, yeah. Um, okay, so if you press this button. And can we press that button again? No. Right. We know as soon as we go on there, we're going to end up in a grinder. Can I get this dude off the chair? Please! Please! I'll do anything! Can we not untar that dude? Okay, what about can we turn the power back off? No. So we are left with no choice. Okay, here it goes. Cracker, that were close. <laughs> I'd
Well done, Charlie. <laughs> How convenient. Shit. What's this? Pleased to see you too, Kate. Glad you're alive. Listen, I found out some new information. What? That guy on the ferry? That was not Dumet. That was Joseph Morello. He's a true crime writer. I found one of his books. How's he wrapped up in this? I don't know. In one of the bedrooms, there was a body, a woman. She'd been decapitated. It was Joseph Morello's wife. I saw a photo of her. She was called Michelle. So we're not his first victims. No. Have you seen Mark? Not in person, but I spotted him on one of these monitors. Thank God. I was worried sick about him. But I also saw Demet running around. Video feeds, recording decks, a mixer big enough for countless mics. He's watching everything. It's more than that. He's got utilities running through here, hydraulics, electrics, everything. It's like a nerve center for the whole building. It's a director's suite. Maybe we could use it to find a way out. Look for something to unlock the outer doors. This all connects. This is how he's getting around the house. This, this is a lot. This is top end gear. I mean, I know he's rich, but you could launch a rocket from in here. Take a look at this. That's where Charlie's just been. What is that? The guy we saw murdered. Was it set up? There was no groundskeeper. Why would he do that? To scare us. To get us in the mood for his fun and games. Nice. Charlie would say this guy is a fractured thing. That he's wearing a mask to put what he's doing on a different personality. That's probably just his theory because he can't reconcile a human. Chicago police. Mr. Monday, this is Chicago police. Can you open the door, please? Mr. Monday, I'm Officer Stanley with... Mm. What do you think it is? I think it's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. What's the difference? Crazy implies out of control. Look at this place. This is methodical. That's not crazy. No. Don't go through these doors. Wait, he's wearing the mask as part of the performance. At best, maybe he's insecure about something and it gives him confidence. Insecure? Like, low self-esteem? Is he uncomfortable at parties? Does, did his mommy not hug him enough? He's been tracking us since we arrived. 
Mark was last seen in the basement. Bad parenting can definitely be a factor. But Charlie Furnish crushed out. Charlie's not there. Much, or an uncle. Any adult figure, really. Don't you read any of our research? Mm, I just set up the lights. I'm sure he fits the profile. Bullied as a kid, unchecked anger. As an adult, he's either an extreme overachiever or a cipher. Nothing between. That's the outfit. He likes being in a position of power, especially over women. But why this? Why us? Aside from the unhealthy obsession with H.H. H. Holmes, he's copying the M.O. Ooh, Clearly, that? he identifies with Holmes somehow. Hi, Mr. Monday. This is Lucinda Price from Twilight Prairie Care Home. I tried to call you a couple of times. We, uh... I... I understand that you're making voice recordings of your mother. And we do believe you're supporting relatives. And of course, you want to capture those precious memories. But, uh... We've had complaints from some of the other residents who are disturbed. Mm. How did he build all this? Oh, well. Can we use this gear to find a way out? Over here! Look at this. It saw his little tricks of moving walls and crap. Nothing in this shit box is real. He controls everything from here. It's a murder factory. You're right. It sure is. We should use this against them. All right. What's your plan? Okay, look. He's in here, right? So we get him to go down this hall, and we trap him between these two moving walls. There's no other way out of there. He'd be stuck. So how do we get him to go down that hall? One of us is going to have to be bait. No, no way. It's too risky, Jamie. So is letting him run free. I'd say that's more dangerous. Come on. No, no, no way. If something goes wrong, one of us will be dead. Yeah, I'm not super into doing it, but I am done being scared of what's around every corner. There's no second chances here. Who's gonna do it? It's my plan. Mm. I'll be the bait. Jamie, no. Let's find another way. You don't have to do this. One of Somebody's got to do it. If you're sure, just... If it looks like it's going south, get the hell out of there. No argument here. You could use that as a weapon if need be. I'm going to hang on to it. I'm more likely to need it. Yep. Ah. Please come back. That's I will plan. do my very best, darling. <laughs> Group hug. Come on, we ain't got time. We need to trap him. Okay. That's enough of a moment. Let's do this. Stick to the plan. Obviously. So how do we get out? Third floor must be a work in progress. Okay, be ready. You're gonna have to time it right to trap him and not me. Oh, be careful. I'm not more quick time events. You'll be careful? If I see Demet, he'll wish I hadn't. I will do my best. Be serious, please. Just tell me you'll be careful. Tell me I'll see you again. Erin, I promise. You'll see me again. Good, because I think I, I think I love you. Oh. Or something. I, I mean. Well, now I have to come back. Yeah, we do. All right. 
Here goes nothing. Head down the hall, keep to the right. Was this on the map? Mm, probably not. Ah, uh, you didn't get me that time. <laughs> being built. Before I go in there, oh, this is a dead end. So, oh, hello. Ah. 
so he's going to get gassed. Oh, is that where I looked through? Yeah, yeah, okay. So that door opens, this one does not. So it's pretty obvious where we're going. Shit. Uh, Damn, bitch. Is he one of these killers who just walks but is right behind? I hate quick time events. Oh, she's running. Uh, run. Oh, she had to fall over. Have we got him? Have we got him? I bet he's got a way out. He's going to have a way out. I'm telling you now, he's going to pop through that darkness there. What did I tell you? Stab him. Jab Damn him. Me. Fucking run. Oh god. Uh he's playing. Oh my god. He wants you in there. Oh, another one falling over. She'll have an asthma attack. And now we all split up again. What did I tell you? Why, why are you going in rooms? symbol on it don't touch it what does it Shit, no jam it with your screwdriver uh, 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 move move ah. Ah. that's doing a lot But then she you gets towards me. You mean? Yeah. This thing will kill me if I don't press it. Wait. I know. If I do press it, then you're the one that dies. God damn, do that! This is exactly what he wants. He's making you choose which one of us dies. I'm sorry. Can we not I'm jam so the sorry. gear? Can you see any gears? I can't do this. I won't kill you. Is there anything else we can do? Anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Jamie? I'm not doing it. I'm not playing this game. Look out for Aaron. For me. Promise? I promise. 
No, fuck. Jamie! Oh, it's Thank gonna make a mess. Thank you. Survive, okay? Oh, no. Don't look at me like that. I tried my best. Excruciating way to go. I know. Jamie wouldn't press the button. She chose to spare Kate at the cost of her own life. Admirable. People can surprise you sometimes. Hmm. Meanwhile, Charlie has proved himself capable, surviving the furnace and every other obstacle. That's not good. I wanted them to live. <laughs> Who would have thought it? Mm. Did the hint I gave you earlier help? No, because it was a riddle. I did not understand it one like bit. Another. <laughs> Who won then? Have you read The Valley of Fear? Yeah, of course the I have. The last of the Sherlock Holmes novels and one yeah, of the I just best. finished it yesterday, actually. <laughs> The temptation to form premature theories upon insufficient data is the bane of our profession. Yeah. You should get back. I hope these chats are helpful. I certainly wouldn't want them well, to be intimidating. No, a bit confusing. I'll be watching your progress. Okay. As always, watching very closely. I'm sure kill is you. Hello. Uh oh. Ah. Oh. Oh, so we do survive. Oh, shattering expectations. Come on. Well, I thought I killed him, but hey. <laughs> I owe you. Come on. Aaron, what happened to you guys? We're both alive. That's all that matters. Oh, there he's he back. <laughs> Charlie boy. Oh, and it's not Charlie, it's uh, Mark. Uh, come on, hurry! Wedge it, lock it off, barricade it, do something. He's got a jabber. Is he gone? That's a no. <laughs> He's gonna grab you through that window. Just go. Kick him. Boss. Get away from me. Yeah, because I'll never think of looking in there. Breathing. Why would you have lockers on a roof? Three, four, four. Get that out ready. Just breathe. Breathe. Shh. Ooh. 
getting closer. Fly out and jab him with your uh, sparkle stone. What's that? Having with your crystal thing. Ow! No, 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 don't you die. Don't you die. Get your crystal and jab him. Help. No, 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 we can't have that. <laughs> uh, run. Uh, run. I probably should have read, but, you know. Oh, nearly. Ah, oh, no, run, but, oh, damn it. Tell her to run. Run! No, run! He's gonna drop me. Nah, do it. Oh, hang on. She might be alive. I think she's alive. <laughs> Kept pausing it before it'd have to restart. Oh, yeah, hey, she's alive. You all right? <laughs> I guess. A bit concussed, but How could you know. You just leave her like that. Well, I can see into the future. I know what would have happened. Then let's go. Run. Well, running, walking, right behind. He thinks he's Michael Myers, bless him. Keep going, hurry up! Are we in a maze?
split up again, haven't we? Oh no. We're all Mary, together. You alright? I got lucky. Shh, you're still out there. Uh, before we wander off that way, there's nothing around here, is there? Uh, little secrets are hiding anywhere. Oh, what's this? Down here, I guess. Oh, I found me some secrets up there then. Can I go back? Can I go back? Come on, what's this? Okay. I guess this maze was a cute garden feature once. Uh, just not tell us where we are. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, you yeah, twit! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Freaking heart attack. <laughs> oh, dear. Thing. Freaking me out. In it. Um, let me check these pictures first. Totally turned around. We're not getting out of there. Hello. This is a not a dead end. That's a dead end. Listen, there's something I noticed about Dunette. Aha. What? Okay, listen, when I was a kid, I didn't speak much. Big surprise. No, I mean, like, at all. They called it selectively mute. Like, I could talk, but I chose not to. And what's that got to do with Dumet? We've never heard his voice. So... One of the things they said about it, the psychologists, was that I was hiding. That I was scared that if I spoke, I would give away my identity. That's the same as Dumet. Obviously, he wants to disguise who he is. No, it's more than that. 
There's a conflict in his identity. He doesn't even know who he is. It's like he's caught between being two people. Or he's trying to separate the killer from the regular guy he is arrested at the time. Maybe. Well, good thing you didn't become a killer. Give me time. Uh-huh. Cables. All these things they could be using as a weapon and they don't bother taking out. So she takes that. Power up the mains. Yeah, like nothing's gonna go wrong when I do this. Maybe we can get this thing working. And the power box is where? Where's this power box then? Aha! Cables. Just put it down into on. A bit of secret passages. What's the worst could happen if we go down here?
morning, Chicago. We begin today with some breaking news. Chicago police today confirmed the body of a man found in a fire at an abandoned warehouse in the Fulton River District to be that of missing FBI agent Hector Monday. Monday has been identified. Right, and we'll leave that here for this part. Catch you in the next one.